Friends, 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 boy, do we have some stuff to talk about. Dollar General, what are you doing? So, some crazy things happened again last night through the night. If you are a penny shopper, you are going to want to stick this one out and watch this video in its entirety. We need to talk about what Dollar General did through the night. So we're going to talk about that in this video. We're also going to talk about the Christmas confusion. Lots of confusion going on with Christmas. Is it going to go further than 50%? All that fun stuff. I've got memos for you I want to talk about. And we're going to go over those as well as the New Year's Eve confusion. So lots of confusion. Dollar General was busy bees again last night. I've been up all night. Looks like Dollar General's been up all night. Let's talk about it. Okay, let's start with the easiest one first, and that's New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve, if you watched my video on Friday, you will know that New Year's Eve was scheduled to go to 50% off on Sunday, and the balloons were scheduled to penny on Sunday. So we knew this on Friday, and if you're a regular follower and watch my videos as soon as they come out, you knew this on Friday as well, because I put a video out on Friday for you, explaining all that to you. So the New Year's um, seasonal stuff did not penny. It's not supposed to penny. It won't penny for a little bit. It never does. The balloons always penny on the first and they did on the first, which was Sunday. And the seasonal stuff did go to 50% on Sunday as the memo said that came out on Friday. So that's that. Guys, it's a reminder when those videos come out, even the penny list videos, I will go ahead and watch them for you know, times just like this because this was actually a Sunday penny list, Sunday markdowns, as opposed to Tuesday. So the takeaway from that is, yes, balloons pennied on Sunday, and the New Year's Eve seasonal went to 50%. It's still 50%, and it will stay 50% probably till next week. So that's it for New Year's. Let's talk about the Christmas confusion going on everywhere. Okay, lots of rumors out there. People saying their managers are saying they're putting everything away. It's not going to drop more than 50%. They're packing it all up, sending it back. This happened last year too. Same exact thing. And in fact, we got a very similar, might even be the identical memo, very similar memo, at least definitely that. So let's talk about where I believe this confusion is coming from. And is this true? Okay, so this is a portion of the memo that Dollar General received on Friday. And what this tells them to do is to move all unopened gift wrap to the receiving room, meaning it's uh, going back, and to pull open gift wrap and it lists all the different things out there and leave that uh, at the front of the store. And so this definitely implies that Christmas is to be sent back. But what they are referring to, it seems, is the excluded items. I do not foresee that they're sending all that Christmas stuff back from this year to be put out next year. It just doesn't make sense. And they've never done that in the past. Granted, they're doing all kinds of crazy things. But I'm 99% sure that there is a possibility that the excluded items, and we're going to I'm gonna show you a list of those, that those maybe get boxed up and put in the back room if they're unopened boxes. Okay, and here is a list of those items that are excluded. And all this means is these items will not drop in percentage. They're going to be full price now. They were on sale up until yesterday for 50% off. We talked about that in a video when Christmas was going to 50 and I talked to you about that, talked about the sale, but that sale is over. So these items are full price and there's a good chance you're not seeing them in your store anymore and they probably have been moved to the back room. But the rest of the Christmas items and the stationery and the air care, the seasonal, the home decor, all that stuff should still be out in your stores. If it's not, I would assume that a DM or even a truck driver that they're expecting to return all these items may intervene and correct that situation. So that's it on Christmas and let's move into what Tyler General did through the night. Okay, friends, this is super odd, super odd. First time I've seen what I'm about to talk to you about as I was looking for your surprise pennies. And by the way, nope, I did not find any in case that's what you're waiting on. 
did not find any, but I did find this. And even if you don't care about sun care as a penny shopper, being informed is super important. So you may want to stick in there for this one just so I can show you what happened because uh, it's very interesting. Okay, so let's have a look at the sun care. So what I want you guys to do is I want you to check these at your store. See if this is your miles may vary. Let me know in the comments what you find if you're finding the same thing that I found through the night. Let's look at these one by one. We're going to do this kind of quickly. But this first one right here has for me reset to full price. Okay, but what I find it very odd is the next two that are going to pop up. I am going to leave them up so you guys can grab these JPCs, try them, and let me know what you find. But then this one and the next one remained at 90%. So that is super, super odd in my opinion. But I'm curious what you all find at your stores and your states and your locations. Honestly, with this, it's more concerning to me that it did happen. Not so much. I'm not so much worried about the sun care. In fact, a lot of these things are close to expiring or expire early in the year. I was a little concerned with how effective they would be come summertime anyway. But it is a little concerning that it looks like a lot of these have reset. Not all, which is the very odd part. Okay, so here is what I found. I'm going to let these scroll again. I want to try to crowdsource on this too. Let me know in the comments. Are you guys finding the same exact thing? Is it different at your store? Um, drop me something in the comments. Check these UPCs for me and let's all work together to gather information in the comment section of this video and see if we can't figure out what is going on with these. Okay, friends, so at least in my area, this is what I'm down to. It's these two right here are 90% off, and the rest of the sun care has reset to full price. So very interesting. Let me know in the comments what you found. I'm really curious what you guys have going on in your stores. So as always, if surprise pennies do pop up, I will definitely get you a video out right here on this YouTube channel. Um, if it's something small, I'll probably put it on the website. The website is up and running again. So I'll look over there for any information possibly or right here on this YouTube channel. So I did have another very fun video that I think you guys would love. Um, very good information for penny shoppers. And it's something you guys have loved in the past. Now I will say all this craziness with Sun Care has me a little hesitant to drop it. But I most likely will drop it later. Um today or early evening ish so be on the lookout for that i'm most likely we'll just go ahead and put it up for you with a huge disclaimer but anyway a lot of fun stuff coming make sure you're subscribed with all the craziness happening at dollar general lately which we know it's been they're throwing curveballs left and right having a hard time keeping up with them but we do keep up with them over here and with all this going on the name of the game is going to be to stay informed have up-to-date information and as most of my regular viewers know, we're pretty on top of stuff over here. We keep up with it, we watch it, we watch it regularly, and we get it out to you as soon as we know something has gone on or changed. So please make sure you are subscribed so that you can stay informed as things come up or happen at Dollar General. Insane amounts of changes lately. So hopefully I'll get this video out to you guys later today. So again, be on the lookout for that. Give this video a thumbs up, please, and leave me a comment in the comment section down below. It does really help me in the YouTube algorithm. And please share this information out with a friend that you know that Penny Shops 
Uh, we have hit 30,000. We're on a quest for 40,000. So share it out, guys. It does help. Y'all have a great day, and I will talk to you in the next one. Bye, guys.